Giving you a live look at San Francisco where dozens of teachers at City College are about to lose their jobs and students are about to lose access to hundreds of classes. As KPX 5's Da Lin reports, despite loud st protests of students and staff, the Board of Trustees approved the cuts in the last few hours. Teachers and students had camped out in front of the Student Services Building for the last three days in protest. After the Board of Trustees voted to make the cuts, the demonstrators packed up their bags and left in anger. President Bridget Davila? Yes. A disappointed crowd reacting to the yes votes. The motion carries uh, with five eyes and one no. Yes. The group watching the Board of Trustees meeting on City College campus Friday evening, and many realizing they'll soon lose their jobs. I'm a single parent. And what does this layoff mean now? It means I have no idea because the HR folks haven't told us when me and my daughter's health insurance are going to crash. Patricia Miller studied at City College in the 90s. She returned and has been teaching in the theater department for the last seven years. I got tenured and pink slipped in the same month. The board voted to cut roughly 300 classes, lay off 38 full-time teachers, and stop the rehiring of 138 part-time teachers in the next academic year. I'm personally devastated because I love working here. I love my students, but it's not about me. It's about the opportunities that are going to be lost. If you cut faculty, you're going to have to cut classes. And so students are not going to have the opportunities that they need. Before the vote, dozens of teachers and students camped out at City College to protest the cuts. On Thursday, police arrested about 10 protesters for blocking a street. City College officials say they need to cut classes and teachers because they're facing a multi-million dollar budget deficit. They lost a lot of students. In 2012, City College served about 73,000 students. Today, they have about 25,000 students. A lot of people left after the college almost lost its accreditation 10 years ago. And the college says if they don't fix their budget, they may lose it and be forced to shut down. City College says once they get more students and the budget improves in the future, they'll rehire those full-time teachers who will soon lose their jobs. At City College of San Francisco, I'm Da Lin, KPIX 5.